Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I want to share my delicious chocolate banana muffins today. I promise you will like this soft and semi-sweet recipe. Before we start, preheat the oven to 375 degrees Fahrenheit. We will work on the wet ingredients first. Begin with mashing 3 bananas in a bowl. It doesn't need to be perfect. You can use a fork like I do. I like to see chunky pieces here and there to get texture while eating. Here I add a 1 fourth cup of melted coconut oil mixed with 1 fourth cup of unsalted butter. I mix them both into half a cup, then add 1 egg, give it a little stir, and last but not least, add a half a cup of cane sugar, mix it well, and put it aside. In a separate bowl, we will mix the dry ingredients. Start with a 3 fourth cup of all-purpose flour, half a cup of almond flour, 1 teaspoon of baking powder, 1 teaspoon of baking soda, 1 fourth teaspoon of cinnamon powder, and a pinch of salt. Mix everything together and we are going to combine it with the wet ingredients. Don't forget we are working with almond flour, so we have to sift it. You don't want to get big lumps of almond flour in your delicious muffins. After everything is combined, add chocolate chips. It's totally adjustable on how much you want. I'm doing extra chocolate today because my husband loves a lot and your batter is good to go to bake. I baked them for 20 minutes total. I would recommend to try 15 minutes first to see if your muffins are rising and have a nice brown color on top. That means it's ready to go. Some ovens will take longer than others. It also depends on how big of your muffins are as well. Keep in mind that this recipe has almond flour. If your muffins aren't raised as high as you used to bake, don't panic. Wow! 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 Okay guys, this is it for today. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't done it yet. See ya!